A town in Lawrence County spent the past three years playing a game of telephone with AT&T. Neighbors worried nobody was on the other end. And people in Hillsboro wanted the phone company to fix a landline, but their calls went unanswered. And tonight's I team consumer complaint, Way 31's Cat Reed, got on the line with the company, and things finally changed. There are two sides to Hillsboro's Oakdale Avenue. We live in the rural parts of Lawrence County, but we take pride in where we live. On one side, the giant trees for which it's named. On the other, a tangled web of branches and telephone lines. It gives it a, a so I. This tale of two roads started in February of 2014 when a tree fell, taking an AT&T landline down with it. When we got in touch with them, they came back out and strung their other citizens line along this tree line. It's been like this like three years. All that time, Hillsborough Mayor Charles Owens says AT&T also strung him along. This is some of it here. This was the solution. Running the line through the tree branches, only held together by knots, tape, and a prayer. They got it put together with like band-aid here and a band-aid here and a patch here and a patch there. When we have telephone service, that's disrupted, we can just about come out and find it ourselves. It's especially concerning for Owens, considering how many elderly people in the area rely on the landline not only for their daily calls, but also for safety. What if we got some senior citizens that don't have cell phones and they lose their service and can't call 911 because of the landline? The Way 31 I team contacted AT&T. Three weeks after we made contact with the company, crews were out here on the scene to fix the landline. Mayor Owens is thankful this side of Oakdale Avenue will again live up to its name. But one question remains unanswered from his game of telephone with AT&T. Why did it take three years? They never came. But if myself, my neighbors miss a phone bill, one day our service is disrupted. AT&T also couldn't tell us why the line is just now getting fixed. The answer to that question, apparently lost on the line. Reporting in Lawrence County, Cat Reed, Way 31, Hometown News. And once the landline is buried, Mayor Owens plans to trim the trees along Oakdale Avenue and clean up all the debris. He also hopes to one day widen the road to accommodate more traffic. And Way 31 is committed to digging, asking the tough questions and keeping you informed. We have a team working hard to bring you all the latest on not only this story, but every story that we cover. You can find it all online at waytv.com.